<laughs> hey, there we go. The Unicorn Dimitri Vandenberg Nowhere Darts Review begins right now. It's gonna be going on, guys. What's up, guys? Worldwide here, man. We got a great video for you today. You really can't go wrong here. Straight barrel, multi-ring, super skinny, and uh, kind of on the light side, yeah. We're gonna hit a home run with these things. So in today's video, we're gonna be taking a close-up look at the unicorn, Dimitri Vandenberg, Nowhere Darts. So tell you what, I'm so excited about this video. I won't keep you guys waiting any longer. So let's just grab the other camera. We'll uh, get these things unboxed. Well, they're already unboxed. But uh, yeah, we'll do the little unboxing. After that, we'll take a close-up look, go over the stats and dimensions, and then I'll talk a little bit about the grip. And then my favorite part of the video, I get to take them to the board, throw them for a little bit, and while I'm throwing them, I'm gonna give you some feedback on what I think of the unicorn Dimitri Vandenberg Nowhere Darts. So here we go, guys. Come on, let's give me a good one. Okay, I'll say this right out of the gate. I believe Unicorn, in my opinion, has some of the best darts packaging in the business. Now, when you compare the price of these to other companies' higher end darts, yeah, I think the display cases or the display packaging is absolutely unreal on these unicorn darts. Let me know what you think about that. But in the corner here, 90% tungsten, 21 grams. And if you see that, the weight match guarantee within one tenth of a gram, these darts right here are some of the best match weighting I've ever weighed. So we'll check that in a minute. But yeah, we have this slide out little sleeve there. And then look at this. I mean, it has this fold out here and we have, remove this foam section, ba-boom. There's the darts. Those things are a thing of artwork. Absolutely beautiful. You know, I love black darts out of the package. They do get kind of beat on after a while. We also have this slide out, Dimitri Vandenberg card. And you know what I'm going to do? I will take a picture of this. If you look down in the pinned comment right now, you'll be able to check out this card. I'll take some pictures or maybe I'll even scan it. So uh, yeah, there they are. Beautiful packaging. But what do you say we get a little bit Closer look at these darts, and we'll go over some stats and dimensions. Can't wait. Okay, there we go. A little bit closer look at the darts here. And man, we got these beautiful black coated Dimitri Vandenberg barrels. We got the medium length unicorn stems and the standard size unicorn flights on the back end. But running down some stats and dimensions, these are a 90% tungsten barrel. The barrel length coming in at 48.6 millimeters long, and the barrel width. Um, you know what? These are actually claimed as 6.2 millimeters wide. I double checked these like a million times over being a straight barrel dart. I got 6.1 millimeters wide on these things. So uh, rather on the thin side, which I quite like. Now, check this out, guys. The match weighting on these things, they were advertised as 21 grams. They did come in a little bit light. However, almost perfect match weighting. The first barrel went on the scale 20.79 grams. The other two barrels, 20.80 grams. So only one one hundredth of a gram off. As you saw in the Unicorn warranty, and the match weighting warranty, they were warrantied within one tenth of a gram. Nah, Unicorn's not having it. One one hundredth of a gram. Wow, absolutely incredible. So uh, yeah, let's get a close up look at these things and I'll tell you about the grip. Okay, let's get a little bit closer look at these things. And uh, you know what, I'll tell you what, if you look at this dart, right, it's about as basic as you can get. Straight barrel, multi-ring. And I'm telling you right now, and I've said this on numerous videos, you just don't need darts with all this fancy machining or anything like that. I mean, honestly, next time the PDC is on TV, have a look at what most of the top professionals use, and you're just going to see a boring straight barrel multi-ring dart. But I tell you what, it just works. It's been proven over the years. And uh, yeah, I guess there's my little rant. But yeah, looking at these things, it's actually the exact barrel that Dimitri uses. However, he uses the natural tungsten version. But yeah, these things are absolutely beautiful out of the box, but as with any black coated barrel, they are gonna get dinged up over time. But man, I don't think there's too much of a better looking dart out of the box. But as you see there in the middle of the barrel, we have these wider multi rings. And then on the back end of the barrel, we have these three machined multi rings there. As far as the grip level goes though, I mean, what would your guess be looking at that? I mean, what, what, would you, what would you guys say on a scale of one to five? But you know what? These are actually pretty surprising. They are extremely smooth. No sharp edges anywhere. This middle section, I mean, honestly, it almost feels smooth. I'll go ahead and give it a grip level two. Does that surprise you? Yeah, grip level two on a scale of one to five. And we've got the unicorn logo 
up front with, right underneath that, we've got Dimitri's signature. Black points on the front end, so you know they're going to stick in the board well. And then we got an ever so slight lip on the front end. As you guys know, I will be adding the Trident 180 nose cones. We got these medium length unicorn stems and the Noir. Noir, I know, I guess I'm pronouncing, I'm probably butchering the pronunciation of that. But yeah, we got the kind of standard size flights on the back end. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to use come the throwing part of the video. I might go with a stock setup, but I might experiment as well. So yeah, let's see how this is going to go. We'll get them on the board. Come on, guys. Straight barrel, multi ring dart. You know these are going to fly well, especially being 6.1 millimeters wide. But yeah, let's get these on the board. See how they fly. Here we go. Okay, guys, let's have a few throws with these things. And if you notice there, I'll actually put a picture up on the uh, dartboard. But uh, I'm doing something I haven't done in a while. I wanted to go with an all-black setup, and I threw on my old Cosmo stems and flights. They are the um, number three Cosmo locked carbon stem and the Fit Flight Pro V1 flights. Great combination for these darts for me personally. They just get to the board in such a hurry. Um, absolutely zip to the board, real straight as well. So hey, that's a bonus. But uh, let's see how this goes. And um, funny enough, I have no idea why I wore a long sleeve today. You guys ever play um, darts with long sleeves? It's not all that fun. Pretty boom. Man, what a nice tight group as well. I'll tell you what. Man, I've done a ton of reviews recently. These are really high on the list. And, um, you know, I've, I've probably mentioned this a couple times in the video. I think I mentioned it at the end. If you don't want to splurge the money on these, just go for the natural tungsten version because, man, it is such a great set of darts. Really love these things. Now, as far as the grip goes, I mean, we talked about that er earlier in the video, but um, my point of finger and thumb, pretty much on these wider multi-rings, kind of right in the middle of the barrel. I mean, this will work well. I mean, you can be a front gripper, obviously a middle gripper. The rear grip, you've got three multi-rings on the back end, so... I mean, it's just a dart that's going to work well for most players. There's absolutely not finding too much wrong with this. I'm sure if you, if you do prefer a dart with a little more grip, then, um, you know, you might not like these. But I still think it's well worth a... well worth a try, anyway. And honestly, for a set of darts this nice with the, with the beautiful, nice packaging, I don't really think they're all that expensive. I mean, you compare them to some other brands. Uh, there's been a couple launches recently. If you look at the prices of some of those darts, yikes. And the packaging that those darts come with, not the greatest. Like, nothing super fancy. Oh, just pulled it. Oh, hey, first start was good, right? <laughs> but uh, yeah, you know what though? These, um, I haven't used these Cosmo flights in quite a while. They seem to work really well with my throw. I mean, I had dartitis in the past, so these smaller flights, I find them a little more forgiving with my wonky throw. They just seem to go a little, a little more straight. Of course, now that I said that, oh, all right, I thought I'd chuck one right in the five. Or the one. <laughs> yeah, Dimitri is doing... I think he's on the rise again. He's been having an incredible year. He lost to... Didn't he lose to Fallon Sherrick? And then I think he fell off a little bit after that. But now he's picking things up, and I really hope to see him do well for the remainder of the year. What a great talent, young kid. And um, look for him to do well in the World Championship, that's for sure. Hey, there we go. We started off well, didn't we? Well, that's enough, guys. I'll um, get this video uploaded today. It's a little bit past 10, 10 a.m. in the morning. So, uh, yeah, let's uh, wrap this up. But, hey, guess what, guys? We do have not one, but two more clips. So you know what's coming next. And then afterwards, we're going to roll into a little bit of a fake nine darter. 
that I, or no, 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 I take that back. A fake 11 darter that I hit just goofing around, warming up with these things. So I hope you guys enjoy these last two clips and here we go. Get in there. Wow. Nice deflection on the second dart. Second, third, and that's the first. Hey, so there it is, guys. Great place to end the video. I really hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, please feel free to slap a like on this video. Make sure you subscribe as well because I may be giving these away in the near future. Oh, and hey, boom, instant replay. So, um, yeah, there it is, guys. Great set of darts, highly recommend these things. And again, if you don't want to shell out the money for this version, go with the natural tungsten version. You simply cannot go wrong with this set of darts. Absolutely love them. And oh, hey, by the way, guys, we do have one more clip. I was just goofing around a little bit earlier and uh, we'll roll into a fake 11 darter. So I hope you guys enjoy, the, uh, enjoy this last clip. We'll see you on the next video, guys. Later. Three in a row. So if I was playing an actual leg, 81. <laughs> 11 are a fake 11 darter. <laughs> 